Carson and I are headed out and we wanted to show you something that we have as a traveling companion to keep us entertained. This is... Juggles the teddy bear. He's like 100% haunted. Yep. And we are I-15 headed to Weston, Idaho where my grandparents are buried. And we are having a good time. And everybody, look where I'm standing. Just got a blacksmith call. shop. Here's Carson. Hello, someone calling me right now. Oh, hello, mother. Here's Grandpa's shop. Definitely run down. There's your house way back there. Definitely run down. And here's a view. It does look like there's people that live here now. We're gonna go to the cemetery now. Hello, Western Idaho has changed a lot. There's a lot of inhabitants with a lot of owned things on their property, toys, metal, sticks, tires, garbage. Uh, yeah, this is across the street from the cemetery. I'm showing Carson the cemetery now. And here's family of Frank and Hilda Olson. I don't think anyone's been here in a while. I need to clean this off, but this is Frank and Hilda Olson, Tamara's mother and father, and some other gravestones around of family members. We, this is the town that my mom grew up in almost in 1938. That's 1940. Um, it's changed a lot. There's, um, there's a lot of people that like to store items on their property. <laughs> it's it's, it's kind of trashy. I'm looking at the end of the, I'm at the end of the cemetery going to just do a panoramic of how the landscape has changed since my mom grew up here. This is the head of the cemetery. And we're looking back towards the town. This way, several blocks. A lot of farming and... I'm coming out of the cemetery facing the direction of the house that you grew up in mom this is what i see i'm approaching the baseball fields where we spent a, some family reunion time with the frank and hilda and the church is in the background there's still the bleachers and the picnic area still is here obviously the school was taken down several years ago and the church the large church is in the background behind the tennis courts. Here's the other side, looking on the side of the cemetery, some of the change of the town that you can see. And now I am looking at the post office where our grandmother used to walk to get her mail. It is still available for service. Although small, now I'm driving down the main street where every once in a while we would see a parade. <laughs> Those are fun times. They, they threw so much candy at us. And obviously there's a horse over here where the general store that I remember. So the and house in which grandma grew up in, Grandma Tamra, is coming up on in view. It has changed considerably. There's quite a bit more vehicles parked in front. It looks like a tribe of people definitely live there. And it's really run down. And it's really not kept up at all. Um, it's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> but this is a street that Tamara grew up on. As you can see, it's changed quite a bit since she was here in the 1960s as last. Uh, this is this house looks like it's a little bit more modern and well kept. 
but these are the streets that your grandmother enjoyed playing on and wandering through as a youth and that's what that amount since the 1960s that's you're seeing how much growth happens in in a small very small community looking out towards some more property owned by the residents of Weston here this is on the other side of the street I do remember a structure that my cousins and I and siblings used to play in that we we deemed haunted but I believe it has been torn down and replaced with some of these other structures but we used to like to go into that house and there was ghosts or something you can see the beautiful view of the mountains in the background what a lovely place it is to I'm noticing up. this lovely piece of equipment parked on someone's property that looks like it's to transport children they don't have any laws or ordinances on in the county to restrict people from parking big old buses big old rainbow buses <laughs> so I feel like that this would be interesting to mother as well oh this is more of Weston Idaho change and growth and now we are headed out of town this is one of the iconic structures that is very memorable to my siblings and I as we rounded the bend it's almost like the song going to grandma's house was meant for us because we would often come when it was snowing or winter in this bend and we would see these silos and it would mean we're almost to grandma's house. Beautiful view of the valley, Cache Valley. It's a clear day for the most part, but it has been a little bit rainy, but I do love those mountains in the distance.